الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله السلام عليكم everyone Usually Maya is my teacher but today I get to be Maya's teacher and Maya has to be the student Maya, are you ready? I'm going to ask you very hard questions Yeah, Fatima, I'm ready but I'm scared Don't ask too hard questions Okay, just try your best and don't give up, inshallah Okay, inshallah and look, it, oh, and look, it says Fatima the teacher. And you have? And, and I also have a badge. So cute. You look just like a teacher today, Fatima. Mm -hmm. You are a teacher, right? Yeah. Okay. Since it's the month of Ramadan, I have prepared quiz questions from the Quran. And make sure you play along and have fun with us. And I collected these questions from the new book set, My First Hero's Two-Minute Bedtime Story, from the Quran. And you can buy these books from myfirstheroes.org. Now it's time for the hard questions. And if you get them all right, then you'll get a treat at the end. I'll give it to you. I'm so excited. I hope the questions aren't too hard. Okay, try your best. Okay, so now we open. They already look so fun. Yeah, they're so colorful. I like them. Yeah. The first book is Adam and Hawa and the Tree. Question one. What is your favorite food or treat you wish you could have all the time in general? Hmm, good question, Fatima. That's that's a very hard question, but I think that my favorite treat is uh, Ferrero Rocher. Sounds good. It's a chocolate. Yeah. Alright. The next book is Noah and the Boat of Animals. Question 2. What big thing did Noah Salam build? Hmm, I know this one. Noah Salam built a Huge boat. Yes, you're correct. Okay. Dawood and the Singing Mountains. Question three. What did the birds and animals use to sing about with Dawood? Let me think. Oh, uh, the birds and the animals used to join Dawood salam to make zikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yes, that's correct. <laughs> Yay, I, I got all three right so far. <laughs> Mariam, are you ready for the next book? It's going to be a little hard. I think I'm ready, Fatima. Sulaiman and the, talk, and the talking animals. Question four. Can you name two of the amazing powers Sulaiman ha, alayhi salam had? Hmm, that's a hard one, Fatima. Uh, I remember now. So one of the powers that Sulaiman alayhi salam had was that he could control the jinns. Another power he had was he could also control the wind and talk to animals. <gasps> Mashallah, you, you got four in a row, right? Yes. Okay. Yunus and the big whale. Where was Yunus alayhi salam when he asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to forgive him? Yunus alayhi salam was in the tummy of the whale. Yes, you got it right again. Mashallah. <laughs> Yusuf and the scary whale. Question 6. How many brothers did Yusuf alayhi salam have? Uh, Yusuf alayhi salam had 11 brothers. Yes, you are correct again. Alhamdulillah. These questions are fun. I like it. <laughs> Mariam, Isa and the, and the date tree. What did Mariam alayhi salam eat that helped her feel better right before baby Isa was born? Oh, I know. It's it's in the title. Is it in the title? Let me see. Let me see the yeah. title. Give me the hint, Fatima. Oh, it's a date, right? Yes, it's a date. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> you got seven in a row right. 
Yay, Alhamdulillah, I'm doing so good. Right, Teacher Fatima? Yes. <laughs> Queen Asiya and the Grand Palace. Question 8. What did Queen Asiya ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for in her dua that is in the Quran? Queen Asiya made a dua um, to have a house in Jannah near Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That was the dua in the Quran. Oh, you got it right again. And mashallah, you got so many right and you're almost done. <gasps> Yay, I'm so happy. Musa and the split sea.
but still he taught people Islam. One day the king learned how Yusuf was very wise and very good. So Yusuf left jail and helped the king save as much food as he could. Then one day his brother said sorry. Yusuf forgave them and met his dad. He was so patient and forgiving and they were all so very glad. Learn from his life about what to do. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves Yusuf for being kind and forgiving to his family. And Allah loves you too. <laughs> and you too. Yes. What a beautiful story, right Fatima? Yeah, I like this story. It's also my favorite story. Okay. Now it's time for your gift, Mariam, and that you answered all of my questions and that you are so patient. And that's why I'm giving you the gift. All right, Fatima, thank you. I'm so excited. Let's yes. see. Here's the gift. You can open it now. Hey, you look so pretty, the packaging. Wow, Fatima, it's for Roche. How did you know it was my favorite? You told me at the beginning. Thank you so much. I really like this gift so much. And we can have them together later on. Okay, Fatima? Okay. All right, here's a question for the audience. What is one thing you dream of having as a treat in Jannah? Make sure to put your answers in the comments below and one person from each of our platforms will be chosen by the My First Heroes team and will be given a prize this coming Jummah inshallah. And you can also get good deeds by giving a special treat to a person you love like I did to Maria. Yes, thank you so much Fatima. Make sure to visit myfirstheroes.org to get this 12 story book set um, called Two Minute Bedtime Stories from the Quran. It is very uh, beneficial, very knowledgeable for 2 to 7 years old, also very colorful. And at the end of each book there are questions which you can learn about the, for the heroes that we all know of. The money that you give will also be going to charity to help families in need and plant more trees inshallah. We had so much fun today, right Mariam? And you're such a good student. Yeah, we had so much fun. Thank you, Fatima. You're also a very good teacher. <laughs> Thank you.